If you're a big swim team and you like to order a lot of gear, maybe you ought to check out Swim Outlet Team Division for these reasons. Swim teams receive a 10% discount on bulk orders. Swim teams or organizations get an 8% commission on referred sales. You'll also like their customization services, which is affordable and available at all times during the year for all team gear. With over 50,000 items in stock, you can get most anything you want. Swim Outlet Team Division. You need to try it out. You'll be glad you did. This is the Morning Swim Show for Thursday, February 13th, 2014. I'm your host, Jeff Cummings. The swimming community will turn its eyes toward Orlando, Florida this weekend, where the Arena Grand Prix continues its tour of the United States. There are a lot of famous names in the meet that starts today, but the biggest name of them all will be Ryan Lochte. Lochte hasn't raced since the World Championships, with his knee injury suffered last November, keeping him out of competition until now. Lochte has entered in six events this weekend, and we're anxious to see how he does. Just about every time Lochte's name comes up here at the Swimming World offices, we think of his hilarious sit-down with our Tiffany Elias in October 2011, in which she posed 25 questions to the Olympian. If you've never seen this before, prepare for six minutes of laughter. If you have seen this before, I think you'll agree when I say that it never gets old. So without further ado, we bring you 25 things you didn't know about Ryan Lochte. Swimming World TV here with Ryan Lochte for 25 things you want to know about Ryan but probably didn't know. So let's do it. 25 do it. right at you. We're going to start off with the swim portion of our questions. Number one, what is your typical race day breakfast? Definitely eggs, uh, maybe a glass of orange juice, some pancakes, maybe a waffle or something. Egg whites or the full egg? Oh, full egg. Full egg. Who pushes you the most in practice? Myself and the clock on the wall. Um, those are the two things that really push me, but I mean, there's other swimmers that I'm lucky and fortunate uh, to train with, like Peter Vanderkay, Connor Dwyer. So, I mean, I train with a bunch of good people. After a long weekend of training, what is the first thing you do Sunday morning? I am laying on my couch watching TV with my dog. What TV are you usually watching? Um, some kind of cartoons. <laughs> do you have a favorite? No. Anything uh, that's on? Anything that's on. Nice. Just me and my dog. Chill. What's your dog's name? Carter. All right, Carter. Things you did not know. All right, this is going to be our quick fire question. Hot or cold? Hot. Twitter or Facebook? Twitter. X-ray vision or flying? X-ray vision. Seven times four? 21. <laughs> Esc no, it's not that far. No, it's not 21. 28. <laughs> Escalator Lamborghini. Oh, Lamborghini. Last one, blonde or brunette? Blondish brunette. There we go. Ooh. Hey, a little bit of both. Yeah. Late night fast food, where are you going? Late night fast food, where am I going? I don't eat fast food. I can't really. I mean, I. Yeah. Okay, late night meal, snack, what's your go-to? Pizza. And you heard it, kids. Fast food, not always the best option for you. Pizza. Topping? Pepperoni. Good choice. All right, what kind of laptop are you working on? MacBook. MacBook. Pro. What size? 17 inch. Pretty large screen. <laughs> Describe your ultimate foot long sub. My ultimate foot long sub? Whew. I don't know. I'm getting hungry now, though. You're going to Subway. Um, you just finished practice. What's on it? Um, we definitely have to have some chicken, uh, some bacon some shredded cheese, maybe um, tomatoes and uh, lettuce. With Mayo, some mustard. Ranch. Uh, sprinkling with some uh, salt and pepper, and maybe some oil and vinegar. Woo wee! <laughs> we got a good one. That's a good meal right there. And chips to go with it? Salt and vinegar chips. Hands oh, salt down. and vinegar. Favorite. All right, how do you wash take... Wash it down with a cold Mountain Dew. Good choice. The flavored Mountain Dew or just the regular? Oh, regular. Okay. Yep. All right, where do you buy your jeans? Um, I like Ralph Lauren. What or who is your favorite rapper? Well, of course, Lil Wayne. Of course, Lil Weezy. Lil Weezy and Jay-Z. Jay-Z, classic. Yeah, and honestly, anyone from uh, YMCMB, uh, anyone from the Young Money family, I like. All right, next question. Uh, sexiest language? French. Why not? Why not? I mean, it is pretty. <laughs> do you want kids? 
Yes. How many? No less than two, no more than five. That's fair. Yeah. It's a good family. All right. Piece of technology you cannot live without. Cell phone. Cell phone. I was hoping you'd say that. That leads us to our little bit more personal questions. All right. What is on your cell phone screensaver? Rocks. Rocks. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Rocks. Next question. How much cash is in your wallet? Probably a dollar. Can we see? Yeah. Swimming World wants to know what is inside Ryan Lochte's wallet. It might be not even that. No cash, <laughs> just credit cards. Just cards. Hey, that'll get the job done. All right, next question. Boxers or briefs? <laughs> briefs. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're almost to the end here. I told you, these are getting a little personal. Don't worry. What is your absolute turnoff? A bad kisser. Tell us about your first kiss. I was at the playground in sixth grade. I was up in the castle, and it was with Katie McDonald. I don't even know how I remember that. But yeah, that was my first kiss. Wow, memorable. Yeah. Katie McDonald, if you're watching, <laughs> one lucky woman right there. Yeah. All right, well, that wraps up our 25 questions. Lastly, what magazine do you always keep by your side? I keep this in my back pocket. Swimming world. You heard it right there. Well, that was Go 25 things you didn't know, but now you know about Ryan Lochte. Thanks for watching. Check out our other interview on the website with Nathan Adrian. Are you smarter than Nathan Adrian? You might be surprised what that Cal Berkeley education has done for the swimmer. All right, thanks for watching. Our thanks to Ryan for being such a good sport. That's our show for today. We'll see you next time.